This is Joe Vaklovic from CME Group here in Chicago. The wheat market traded both sides of unchanged here on Thursday. Uh, we kind of shrugged off a bad start, came back to close unchanged. The spring wheat contracts actually finished the day sharply higher and helped to pull up some of those winter wheat contracts. We've got some developing drought and some full-blown drought in some U.S. wheat-growing areas. If you look at the western half of North Dakota, the western half of South Dakota, a uh, very, very bad drought in place right now. We've got developing drought in the southern plains. It's been very, very dry and very, very cold in a lot of hard red winter wheat country. So the market may be building in just a little bit of weather premium here. Um, the Funds who have been heavily short, managed money who's been heavily short, may be uh, exiting or, or heading for the exits here because of some of these adverse weather conditions. So for the moment here, we've got kind of a friendly story from a weather front. It should be said, however, you know, wheat's the crop with nine lives. And uh, if we run into some rain or a change in the weather pattern, we could probably give back a lot of these gains very, very quickly. One concern here that I have as prices rise is that demand will be diminished. You know, we've struggled to, to gain any kind of footing on the export market. And with this rally in prices, we may very well just price ourselves out of the world market. So that is, is one concern as the market works higher here. Again, Joe Vec from CME Group here in Chicago.